Hi everyone, my name is Anand and today we are going to talk about Environmental Assessment Impact, also known as EIA. This notification was issued by the Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change and it is attracting heavy criticism from the public. It falls under Environment Protection Act of 1986 and it is practiced in more than 100 countries. The Save EIA campaign is attracting a lot of attention of citizens on social media platforms expressing their grief. For those of you who don't know what is EIA and why India's EIA is problematic, here is a small sneak peek. EIA is a process which predicts the effect of a proposed industrial or infrastructure project on the environment. It prevents the proposed project from being approved without analyzing the consequences from it. The project includes industrial projects, mining of minerals, thermal, nuclear plants, infrastructure projects, and other projects. The EIA draft has been widely objective for modifying its policies where projects can carry out execution without any environmental clearance. With this draft, the government will have the authority to categorize the project as strategic. For a strategic project, the government shall not disclose any information to the public. According to this new EIA draft, government representatives and project proponents are the only ones who can report the violations. These violations cannot be opposed by citizens. A public hearing gives us a chance for the public to understand the project. This gives us a clear chance to question the credibility of the assessment. This new draft also cut down the public consultation period of 30 days to 20 days. The recent gas leak at LG plant in Vaisal and the fire at Oil India Limited are a sum of few examples which points out the importance of EIA in India. As you can see, the new draft will prove to be disastrous for our forests and habitats and have a huge impact on India's biodiversity. It will be used as gateway by mining and fossil fuel extraction companies to destroy pristine natural habitats without the proper clearances and still get away with it. India has more than 1,200 species of birds and 500 species of animals Going forward with this draft could be a death sentence for our wildlife. A lockdown on the voices of indigenous protectors and environmentalists and a system which puts profit over people and planet. With issues like water scarcity, climate change, biodiversity loss and pollution plaguing India like a virus, it's time we choose a forest and wildfire. It's time India chooses its forest. After all this, you might be wondering what you can do to oppose this move. Well, you can voice out your opinions by sending out an email to this below address. The last date to do so is on August 11th. I really request each and everyone to share posts, videos on this EIA draft to your friends and family. Please voice out your opinions on this. We either need this draft to be modified or to be totally scrapped. Thank you so much for watching this video. Let's make this count. Until next time.